Mongols, Legend Lil. Mongols versus Chinese on the map Altai. I'm gonna send my first scout into the center of the map immediately to see what he's doing and to get as many sheep as possible. And then I'm gonna make a second scout to pick up sheep around the base. There's his Uvu. Yay, let the sheep killing begin. <laughs> hey, at least he doesn't have them either, right? How many sheep is he killing? This is ridiculous. Where's the gold? There. We'll have to punish this sheep murderer. We can't go for the boar. Well, I think uh, we don't have to. Against Mongols, it's too risky. Luckily, I don't really need sheep on Altai too much. I didn't want him to go here. Imperial Academy. He went for pastures, so no rush to do anything. Next, we're gonna get wheelbarrow. He uh, has a full economic opener. Wheelbarrow coming, Imperial Academy coming. Next gold goes to a second official. And then I wanna... Wait, is that a silver tree? 
Okay, I'm going to Gnu Ram all in. There's nothing you can say to stop me. Don't say don't do it, Grubby. Don't say it. I will do it. Thanks for stream. My China hasn't progressed in a minute, so glad you're playing. What? Oh, oh, can I block? Can I block? Ah. <laughs> okay, we have Song Dynasty. How do you like that? Mangy die. Well, too bad for you, bro, because you're gonna destroy Mangy die. Oh, 
Now I need enough wood. Now let's go castle behind this. Duchies for the win, Supermax and Grubby Smile. Yo, Robon, thanks very much. Supermax, uh, F1. I, I stopped making units. You need to go collect gold. It's over, man. Game over, man. You can't dead. Did I lose all my units? Yeah, but we killed enough. Or actually, did we? Um. Did we actually kill enough? Oh, 
It's actually the question if we killed enough. I have a lot of tax gold waiting to be collected. He's trading a lot, right? So we actually need a lot. We killed a lot of villagers, but he's trading a lot, so he's actually quite rich. But he doesn't have castle age yet. Okay, he interrupted his trade route for the knights. I thought Mangidai kind of spank knights. Oh, he got scared. This is open? Okay. Uh, greenery. <laughs> Make some chubinu. Do I have stone? Didn't get stone yet. That's a lot of Mangidai. So he's super committed to Mangidai. <laughs> I think he's committed to Mangidai, guys. <coughs> He wants to make them, is, is what I'm getting here. So let's get uh, ranged armor as well. We've got knights coming. I'm not playing with... Uh, what do I, how do I wall it? Do I wall this? I'm not yet playing with uh, collecting relics. Maybe I should. Uh, horsemen should be better than knights now. Nice, we hit him right when he was looking to hit us. A lot of Mangidai bros. Oh, I 
兵以救济，奉命。大家听好。好的，进往那区。了解一下。还是该 enough yet。好的，需要做做好准备。十字弓。Can't get enough wood, even though I've got lots of upgrades for it. Okay. 前来前来 Question is: Is he going to go Mangonel or not? What's that? Kudal Tai? Oh you, oh you. I think he's gonna get spanked. Kudal Tai was also not working yet, and Khan died immediately. Oh my God! I love the counter table. Hell yeah, bro. Can I still make more granaries? Oh, I have three already. I have three already. Siege workshop? Just dodge lol. Wait, am I supervising the blacksmith? I think I am, by accident. Ah, a mangonel! No! Gold he got. Do you guys think we got more gold or he got more gold? Because he had the trade route set up. I'm gonna say we got more, but then you look at the villager graph, you see that we have 40% more villagers, and you would expect me to have more and more. Let's see. Economy. We got a little bit more, 1k, kind of as I expected. 
but then you look at the villager graph and you see 40% more. Yeah. Yeah, mangoes get one shot. Uh, his biggest gold bank was actually 3,000 gold. Almost well, 2,800 gold. Could he have won after the raid? Was it winnable for him? Could he have won? Could he have won after the raid? Uh, which raid? My raid? Oh, he lost villagers. All right, we fought, we skirmished, and he went. He should have been in a straight line. He should have been here. So he lost from sixty-six to fifty. So he lost about sixteen villagers, and then more twenty. He lost about 20 plus villagers. Uh, if he doesn't get villager kills in return, he can still win, but it should not be easy. Uh, but he, he pretty much just went for like mass Mangidai, right? Like Mangidai makes sense because they, uh, oh, wow. that's quite good, that's quite good. Mangidai makes sense because they uh, are mobile and can defend the trade route, but Instead, you can make more use of outposts and also just have a stronger fighting army and one that can move into the opponent's defenses. So how do unit counters work in AoE? Since you're going with full range, can't you just cavalry charge your archers, Rohan style? Yes. Yes, that is true. The I made Chuganu, a repeater crossbow, which is effective versus light units. So if he goes for men-at-arms, which are like... Uh, they're like grunts, Warcraft grunts, let's say. If he goes for men-at-arms, or if he goes for knights, which are like knights <laughs> in Warcraft 3, then I'm doing one damage per hit, but I am hitting three times, and I'm attacking faster than an archer. So I'm doing four times as much damage as an archer, but an archer is horrendous. And a Juganu then still is only very bad. Not horrendous, but just very bad. And then I would need to deal with men-at-arms with actual crossbows, or with my own knights, or my own men-at-arms, but generally knight or crossbow. Uh, I need to deal with his knights with spears. So that's why I have the barracks set up. So the best thing he could do is to age up quite fast, get a lot of men-at-arms. Honestly, though, if I if I get like 60, 70 Chuganu and all he has is men-at-arms, that's not going to be good enough. That's good enough against archers, but not against Chuganu. I will have too much damage. Mainly he lost economically, but also because he made an army that was only able to win with hit and run. It's almost like he went mass bat riders or mass hippo riders, but then was unable to uh, do any damage to my economy. <laughs>